For all the acquaintance be forgot and never come to mind, we'll take a cup of kindness yet for all as I'm. Happy New Year, everybody! Yes! I don't drink anyways. But anyways, let me introduce myself. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, Jason Charisma in the house. Sexy vegan chef by day, singer slash slaughter entertainer by night. Guys, first of all, I want to say my birthday just passed about uh, two days ago. And I just want to say thank you for all the amazing birthday wishes. All right, boy, did we have a crazy 2020, didn't we? Well, you know what? We're now in 2021, all right? New administration, there's gonna be happiness coming in. We're gonna be able to perform for you guys. Live performances will start happening. People will start getting back together again. It's gonna be amazing, all right? And of course, what we need right now, more than anything other than love, is great, great health, all right? And of course, that's why your boy's coming back. And I'm sorry I wasn't here for a while because I was taking care of my, my albums. All right, I did two great pandemic songs. You know, one's called Everything's Gonna Be All Right. We'll be coming out soon, so don't forget to support that. And also, we will be strong, all right? Not because of these muscles, but at the same time, because I wanna be able to give something for all of you, all right, to make you feel good in the ear, with the energy, and not just with food. But now, we're at 2021, I haven't done this in a while, so I'm gonna bring back some amazing food. Now, something that you guys have asked me is about macaroni and cheese, all right? So we're gonna do a vegan macaroni and cheese for you all today. It's gonna be tasty, it's gonna be healthier, it's gonna be amazing. And you're gonna see how I'm gonna make the cheese with cashews, all right, which of course has tons of protein, the good proteins, all right, and the good fatty acids. And um, at the same time, we're gonna blend that in with some sauteed mushrooms. We're gonna put some sauteed spinach in there. And I'm just gonna season it so well, it's gonna be amazing. You're gonna see how I'm gonna turn it into like a cheese sauce, and I'm gonna blend it in with the fusilli pasta. Did I say that right? A fusilli, 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 babili, babili, whatever, all right? But anyway, it's gonna be amazing, all right? So guys, I missed you all. I hope you missed me too. And of course, how can I leave without doing what I normally do as your sexy vegan chef? Oh, oh, ooh, oh, oh, oh. You feel that? You feel that? Oh, I feel it all right, baby. <laughs> Anyways, all right, so let's get to the cooking, all right? Y'all ready? Let's do this. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so part one of what we're gonna need for this amazing pasta, this amazing healthy pasta, all right? We're gonna have to cut up, all right? I would say two cups of peppers, bell peppers, red bell peppers, don't they look beautiful, I'll tell you. And then after that, we're gonna have to cut up at least two cups of purple onions, all right, and then I would say half a cup of tomatoes, all right? And two cups of mushrooms. Then we're going to need, now I'm not gonna use this whole thing here because then it'll be a little crazy, right? Even though I'm always about going green, right? But I would say about two cups of, two or three cups, depending on how much you want, of spinach, all right? And that's what we're going to use for um, uh, our searing. In other words, we're gonna sear, you know, the mushroom, the peppers, and everything, and make it into a little sauce, and then we're gonna put top it, all right, on top of the pasta. And now we're gonna need the fusilli pasta. This is what I say, the jovial pasta, which I think is gonna be great. I think you guys are gonna love this one. So it actually tastes like pasta, so don't think just because it's rice pasta that it doesn't taste like pasta, it does, all right? And in addition, um, you're only gonna need about 12 ounces of this. Well, I would say um, 24 ounces, because you get 12, and you got another 12, so I would say two, because I like to make a lot, all right? And then we're gonna boil it, rapid boil, and uh, I would say for about um, uh, 10 to 12 minutes, and we should be cool. But until it's al dente, all right? Let's do this. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so part three. So we are cooking and still boiling, cooking at the same time, and boiling the pasta. All right, as you can see, it's looking good. Everything's going fine. Remember, you put the pasta in when it's rapidly boiling, okay? That's the way it's gonna work on that. In addition, um, the onions are here caramelizing, and I also added coconut oil, because coconut oil is the best oil to cook in, as I've told you in my past previous videos. And in addition, we have the pumpkin here, all right? Which, you know, you could call it squash, I mean, squash anyways, and it's, the squash and we're like sauteing it, all right? And we're gonna cook it until it's like really soft, all right? And then we're gonna start seasoning with some black pepper, 
we're going to add some garlic in there. As you can see, I still have the garlic paste right here. All right. And then we're going to add uh, some black pepper. We're going to add some uh, uh, onion powder in there and a little bit of thyme. And then we're going to put it in the food processor, okay? Now, after we do all this, we're also going to add in some of the cashews here that I soaked for about, let's say about eight hours, all right? We're going to add that in there, fit together so it can be more like a cheese consistency, all right? And then uh, we're going to put it in the food processor and bam. Okay, guys, part three of what we're doing here. Everything's looking pretty well here. All right, I put added the cashews in there already and um, everything's caramelizing nicely. So now just to firm it up and also to make it a little liquefy, we're going to add some almond milk to it. <coughs> yes, add some almond milk, Let's stir it up a little bit. All right, this is gonna end up gonna be like a cheese. All right, I know that you can't see with all this smoke, but this is gonna be very, very good. Um, once we put it in the food processor, it's going to be just like a nice, nice cheese sauce. All right, and to give it the little extra, extra added cheese sauce, we're going to put a little bit of nutritional yeast. I normally use Brog's because that's the best one that I can find up in Whole Foods. So, we're going to put some uh, cheese in there, which the Brog is kind of like a cheese. Nutritional yeast, but it, of course it tastes like a cheese. And we're going to add a little bit of vegetable stock. All right, and I would say um, about uh, half a cup of that would be fine, you know, but it just depends on your choice of how much you like, because remember, it's all about taste, all right? So we're cooking that. The macaroni is all boiled already. We're gonna strain it, and then we're gonna put it together, and I'm gonna show you how it's gonna look. All right, let's do this. All right, everybody, look at what is happening here. We put in the onions, we put in the mushrooms, and look at that. And we put in the, um, look at that, the peppers, the bell peppers, look how it's looking so far. Nicely caramelized. Now what we're gonna do to really seal the deal here, make everything good, before we put this on top of the sauce, we're going to add some of this garlic, all right? And only take it with my hand, so, you know, don't try this at home. <laughs> All right, look at that, we're gonna put some garlic. And the garlics have scallions in there too, which is gonna give it that extra, extra, extra added flavor that it needs. Don't mind all the smoke, but oh my God, it's smelling delicious right now. In addition, now the sauce that I did earlier, look at what it looks like now. You see this? Nice, thick sauce. Now what we're gonna do, I'm gonna take this, all right, this little handheld spatula thingy majee thing, and if you look, Look how thick the sauce looks. It's a nice, thick sauce. And let me tell you, we're gonna put that with the pasta and blend it in with, and top it with the um, mushrooms and the bell peppers with the garlic. It's going to be amazing, all right? We're gonna see how this looks once it's done, all right? So, let's finish it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, look at everything here, all right? So we got the macaroni here, all right? And then we have the sauce, all right, from the squash. All right, and with the squash and the, um, uh, the cashews. And now we put everything together with the sauce that we just made with the peppers and the mushrooms. And at the same time, we put some uh, cooked, we sauteed the uh, spinach and look how everything looks together. I mean, is that amazing? I mean, look at the bell peppers. Now we're gonna mix it and it's gonna be like a cheese sauce. All right, look, at, look how thick it is. It look, actually looks like a cheese sauce, right? And that's only because of the cashews mixed in with the squash. I mean, it's just amazing. The most amazing thing. I mean, look at this, all right? I mean, is that beautiful or what? I mean, look at this. It's like magic, 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 magic. It's so tasty, so delicious. You guys are gonna love this, all right? All right, so let me finish mixing and we're gonna see how it looks like, all right? Let's do this. Ladies and gentlemen, and now I present to you finally the finished product, all right? Now, this probably took us about 45 minutes, you know, or less to do, but you know what? It was a great journey, okay? So now I'm gonna present to all of you, since you're waiting to see what it looks like, I present to you J. Cool Charisma's vegan cheese butternut squash pasta macaroni. Look at that. Doesn't that look amazing? Look how cheesy it looks. Look at the texture. Look at the mushrooms. Look at the bell peppers. You have tomatoes in here. 
oh my god, you have the sauteed spinach. Is this amazing? And then of course, decorated with a little bit of raw greens, which will give you the raw vegan nutrients that you need. Is that amazing or what? This makes you want to dance, doesn't it? Oh, yeah, baby! Oh, vegan all the way. Now let's try it and see what it tastes like. May I or shall I? Let's do this. Hmm. Look at that, look at that, look at that. Look how cheesy that looks. Look how cheesy that looks. Look how delicious. See how cheesy? Let's try it. Mmm. <laughs> nah. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Another masterpiece done. Take a charisma in the house. Thank you.